the science guy. Bill Nye, the science guy. Bill, 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 Bill Nye, the science guy. Just like the airplane that seems small when it's far off in the air, but is really big when you see it close by on the ground, the sun only looks small because it is so far away. In fact, the sun is so large, it would take 109 Earths strung end to end to equal its diameter. That's because the sun is big. And the sun is hot, reaching temperatures of about 15 million degrees Celsius at its core. See how my head is blocking the sun? Well, the same thing's happening with the moon right now. The moon is blocking the sun. Here's how it works. The sun is up there, right? Hopefully. Then the moon casts a shadow on the Earth. And that's an eclipse. See the round shadow of the moon? That's all there is to it. It's a solar eclipse. They laughed at me! They laughed! Ha! <clears throat> oh, well, hi. I was just looking at the sun with a pinhole viewer. See, you should never look at the sun directly. You can hurt your eyes. Here's what we have. We've got a white piece of paper taped to this end of the box. Then at this end, we've cut a small hole, see? Then on the outside, taped a piece of aluminum foil. Then using a pin, I poked a small hole. That hole makes an image project through the box onto the paper. And you can observe the sun or a solar eclipse easily. Take a look. See? It works great. Bill, Bill, Bill Nye, the science guy.